Hi, I'm Anastasia. I'm a luxury handbag lover, a Louis Vuitton collector, and I also own a consignment store. You can check out the available items below. In this video, we're gonna talk Damier Eben from Louis Vuitton. If you're thinking about purchasing the uh, bag in this print, I'd love to share wear and tear that you might expect after some time uh, to happen on a Damier Eben bag. So here's a Bergamo GM, very nice and great handbag for work, for office, or well, actually for any occasion in Damier Eben. It's very popular and a lot of people are looking for that. And though it's in great condition, it does show a lot of wear and tear, very typical for any Damier Eben handbag. Let's start. <laughs> First of all, you probably know that canvas is not a real leather, um, but these parts actually are. First type of wear and tear that you will come across on a Damier Ben handbag is scratches and, well, some scuffs on this leather. When, well, you can see the, the very typical scuffs here and here and here. And also on the flap on the flap here. Now regarding the canvas, you know that Louis Vuitton uses one type of canvas for monogram, Damier Azur and Damier Eben bag. And basically the difference in canvas is only in the print, which is painted across the same material, the, the same canvas basically. And uh, if you look at uh, Damier Eben handbags, uh, depending on the year, they all have different layout. They all have different, uh, this, this base material for the print is, is different. I mean, uh, on some handbags, it's uh, dark, it's almost black, and the, you know, the brown print is painted across the black canvas. On some handbags, it's brown. And then we can see that the print uh, on the corners is rubbed to the brown brown material well actually the print is just coming off it does look bad uh, I just want you to be aware of that and well decide if it's good for you or like unacceptable sometimes uh, if the corners are very rubbed on a damier Eben handbag we can see that the canvas is rubbed through uh, until the red lining and the red lining starting to show it won't break i mean it, the canvas won't have a hole um i don't know what what's the manufacturing process but uh, i've never seen any huge problem with that as i said it's not a hole it's starting to showing off you can use any any kind of paint um if that bothers you but uh, overall, that's not a huge issue for me, but it might be for you, that's why I'm sharing that. If you purchase a Damier Even handbag with a strap, you may expect that the strap will be getting softer and softer with the, every year until uh, it has this type of wrinkles all across the leather. It doesn't look bad, nothing happens to the strap, there are no cracks, no potential issues, it, it will just not look like new, like that, right? It will look a little bit wrinkled, which is very normal, and it gets more comfortable on the shoulder. Now, a lot of Damier Ben handbags have red Alcantara lining, which I can't say that it's one of the most durable linings ever. It's uh, like velvet, if you touch it, and uh, well actually after some time it does show uh wear and the this red velvet is coming off and unfortunately there is nothing that, that can be done here uh well you'll you'll be enjoying the bag for several years i'm not saying it will happen the next month you purchase the bag right um however just be aware of that and now the most disappointing thing about louis vuitton bags which is cracking now, if you're looking to purchase a Damier Eben bag or a monogram bag or basically any, any canvas bag, read the reviews, uh, watch the reviews and check carefully if there are any issues with the bag. Because I sold five Bergamo, uh, there were MM, GM, this is a GM by the way, they, they were different and all of them had the same issue. As you can see, the canvas here is folded. And while it's folded, of course, the structure of the canvas is breaking, right? So here, 
we do have one crack here and two cracks on the sides here. So eventually this model, this Bergamo GM will eventually have cracks no matter how you baby it, no matter how you store it and no matter what you do with, with uh, the bag. Well, these were the most important points regarding Damier Eben handbags wear and tear. And if I haven't mentioned something, let me know in comments and uh, well, share your opinion on whether you wanna get a Damier Eben bag or not. Thank you for watching. I hope it was useful. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you would love to see more videos on Louis Vuitton authentication, Chanel authentication and uh, luxury bag reviews. Uh, we have a lot of them. Thank you and see you next week. Bye.